What's up, everybody? How you doing? This is Max Boogie from Wall Street. Y'all week 15, Daniel Taylor, Quincy Blunt, going up against the Pittsburgh Steelers with Big Ben. Le'Veon Bell, Troy Palomalu, all them on the squad. But Big Ben, man, taking sacks in the first quarter. The defense, what's kicking up this first quarter? They get the drop on the third and 14. Ben Roethlisberger, he's doing too much scrambling. He's getting hit, getting sacked. We out here just trying to kick up, you know what I'm saying? This time, we late in the season. It's kind of secured that we got a playoff spot in week 15. We be definitely, definitely leading the division. Uh, I might have like a season update after the last game or something like that. But we gonna try trying out different things right here. You see, Daniel Taylor is in the slot. He was in the, in the passing uh, situations and passing his routes more often because we know in the playoffs we gonna need to change it up. We can't run the ball all season. You know, teams in the playoffs are definitely gonna try to stop Daniel Taylor from running, and definitely with that all Madden cheese. They gonna definitely start stopping uh, Daniel Taylor from running, but this this touchdown I didn't even see it. The the camera only focuses on me. That's the only like downside to this uh, player lock camera. You don't really see everything, so you, we gotta see this replay. It looks like Harry Douglas stole Julio Jones touchdown, but we not gonna say nothing about that, man. Seven to three, we still got the score. Under five minutes left in the second quarter, we over here stuffing up runs. We didn't make a tackle, but we was there to make a tackle if we had to. But this time, number 55, there was nobody next to me. I had to take on two blockers. That last run we set the edge, that one, we, that run, we couldn't. You know, we getting double teamed. One on the outside, one inside. Nothing we could do. But on this next pass and play, man, Prince Shimbo with another sack. Two sacks on the game. We going to come up again. Just above two minutes left in the quarter. This time they try to screen. They don't get it. Mop Big Ben Rockless Burger up off the floor. We over here almost flipped him out of his cleats. You know, he does his occasional Big Ben stuff. He break a tackle, but he does not break a Quincy Blunt tackle. Do you feel me? He almost lifted him out of the stadium. Then we got to celebrate. Then look at him as he run away. Because that was really something serious you can see daniel taylor is he he likes this route man this angle route coming out the backfield they got in a whole bunch of formations you can see we went to the single back bunch found it again in another truck fade in these linebackers they all too little every linebacker in the nfl well now that patrick willis and, and ray lewis retired they all too little you feel me they all too little to tackle daniel taylor one-on-one -on -one. he's just that strong and that quick best running back in the nfl but you see in the passing, in the slot again. Matt Ryan, I have no idea what happened. I guess they didn't want your boy DT3 to, to score a touchdown. But we're going to try that again in the slot. Get a little rub right there. But Matt Ryan decides not to throw it. It's just something he does. He doesn't like throwing it if it's a tight window. He gets the sack. We only get three points out of that. And right before halftime, man, Quincy Blunt was nowhere near that. But we do come up with the pick in the end zone. Uh, Kamal Ishmael is over there wilding. Well, uh, after the halftime, man, we only up by seven. Still a close game. Man, Roethlisberger is starting to pass the ball, actually. He's not looking to just break all the uh, would-be sacks. You know what I'm saying? This time, he drops back out the single back. We end up blitzing because the fullback didn't go out on the pass route. They get another first down. Second and one on the eight-yard line. I see two tight ends on the same side. I knew exactly what that first tight end was going to be doing. It was a corner route. I guessed it right. Unfortunately, he didn't throw. If he would have threw it to the tight end, we would have got the sack. Third and one, I could have swore they were going to do a run up the middle. They do a toss, and we still stop it, holding them to a field goal. And we out here right now. Daniel Taylor getting the ball finally in this game. He got it a lot before, but it was minimum gains, like two, three yards. This time, we do the same play two times in a row. Almost gets a first down twice. Second and inches, we're going to run the ball again. This little quick base play. Break a little bit of tackles, fighting for them yards. This is how we do, man. This is just how we do. Late in the late in the game, starting of the fourth quarter, come out again at this angle route. This time we do not truck a linebacker. We can't do it any time, <laughs> but we do get a decent amount of yards. Second and four, a play action because we, we was running a lot. You know what I'm saying? This time they tell us open again, another catch. And I'm telling you, we, we've been working on it. Later on in the drive on the eight yard line, Daniel Taylor, he fell for about six or seven yards on that one. That's his strength. He almost smacked the Pittsburgh Steelers player in the head. Can he get this touchdown? He fell on purpose. 
the ball was over. He fell just because he wanted to. Just wanted to lay down a little bit. 6 to 17, two minutes left. Can Ben Roethlisberger lead a comeback? They do a screenplay. Quincy Blunt hawking him down. Didn't even see him coming from behind. No screenplay. Now we baiting Ben Roethlisberger to throw this little flat route, but he doesn't. He just takes the sack. Another coverage sack. A minute and 30 seconds left. We go on the blitz. Hesitate a little bit. Gave Roethlisberger enough time to find a man open down the field. So they are getting a little bit close to the end zone. So we trying to hold them off. He over there throwing it deep. Almost got the interception. I'm not even sure. Number 26, I think that's Wilson. I'm not really, really sure if that's Wilson or not. But I do believe it might be him. This time, they keep on throwing it away from Quincy Button. They must have seen the last games, last week's tape of him catching these picks. Thinking I'm about to get a sack, man. I, it's that all Madden. I'm, I'm not used to not playing on this all Madden. You know, you usually got the assist when you're about to sack somebody. But that time, I didn't. You know what I'm saying? So I ran right past them, gave up a touchdown. They down by three. 15 seconds left. Fourth, fourth and seven. They catch the sideline pass. Get out of bounds at the same time. Crazy, bro. It's that all Madden cheese. Can they get in the field goal range and get out of bounds? 11 seconds left. 10 seconds left. They throw it downfield. Double coverage. Could have just passed it short. Maybe got out of bounds. I don't know what he was thinking. You know what I'm saying? 26 is over there again. This time. Five seconds left. We coming on the blitz. Don't matter. They doing the Hail Mary. Big Ben somehow breaks that tackle. Maybe he's doing what he do, but it doesn't matter. We frustrated him long enough so that he going to throw that incompletion. Ends the game. We win by three at home against the Pittsburgh Steelers. You know, it was a nice little, uh, nice little win we put together right here. Kicked up on him in the second and the fourth. They really didn't score that much, but, you know, this is how we do it. That's how the defense does it. That's how the offense does it. We try stuff, try new stuff on offense. Not really worrying about the outcome of these last games because we, we got a good record. We only lost one game uh, this whole season. So, in the playoffs, definitely. It's not going to be a problem. And um, that is about it. You know what I'm saying? Got a nice little game in. I'm going to try to put these videos out more because I feel like I've been on this first season for a while. You can see all the stats right here. Matt Ryan was kicking up. I know Daniel Taylor was definitely kicking up in the passing game. Rushing game, we only had like 55 yards. Steelers defense is really tough against the run, if y'all wanted to know. That 3-4 defense that the Steelers run is real tough. But um, this video is coming to an end. So always remember, in the street we trust, I'm out.